Not great right now, Andrew, speaking to passengers here, a lot very angry, a lot very frustrated. First Great Western have had issues today, signalling problems between South Hall and Slough, uh, and they've knocked on cancellations and delays to services heading out to uh, Reading, Bristol, Cardiff, Oxford, uh, Bedwin in Wiltshire, all affected. So hundreds of people milling around here, a lot of them quite frustrated. I spoke to some of them earlier on. I was going to be there for my mother and she's ill and I've been delayed so and I've got to travel to, from Cardiff to Hay and Wise so that delays because there's no public transport from Cardiff to Hay after seven o'clock so it's quite um, annoying really. It's very frustrating, um, it happens this time every year um, and I think they do need to invest a little bit more in the track and stuff like that. Um, you know, this time of year people want to get home for Christmas, they want to get home in comfort and the problem is really is that you know there aren't enough coaches and there aren't enough trains. Now, I've spoken to First Great Western in the past hour. They tell me that they have engineers out and they really hope to sort out all the signalling problems this evening. So there should be no knock-on effect to tomorrow morning's train services. But looking ahead to the weekend, the Environment Agency say there's plenty of other things weather-wise for people to be worrying about. Certainly we've got a little bit of respite today, but over the next couple of days there's, there's severe weather um, forecast and we would really urge people to be flood aware. They need to know whether they're in a flood risk area or if they're travelling through a flood risk area, whether they're going away over Christmas. And then we would really urge people not to walk or to drive through flood water. It's very difficult to know how deep it is and if there's anything hidden under the surface. And as little as um, 18 inches to two feet can sweep a car away if the water is flowing quickly or just six inches if you're standing it can actually sweep you away off your feet so we do urge people to stay safe and to stay out of flood water